Hey guys, this is Soul Rack 333 with another review, and here I have the Transformers Legacy United Animated Universe Optimus Prime. So I finally found this guy. I found a YouTube video, the usual toy hunt videos, and uh, uh, some chick went to Target, Walmart, and then when she went to uh, GameStop. There was a whole bunch of animated Optimus Primes, and I'm like, oh man, they just closed the two Game Stops in my area, so I would have to go to the next town, north and south, uh, from where I am, where they have like a million Game Stops, and every one of them is out of the way. Uh, so I plan on going there. Uh, but before we did, we went stopped at Walmart, which is close to my house, and there he was. Walmart had him. So, saved us a trip, and this time Walmart beat Target to the punch. And uh, there he is, looking very nice. For some reason, this wheel isn't catching. And yes, I hate animated, did not like the show. I watched the first, I don't know how many episodes, I, I really gave it a, a shot. I liked that it was back to 2D animation, even though it was a little bit too stylized for me. Um, and then I just didn't like the characterizations, I mean, and then I just bowed out. <laughs> I did buy some of the toys back then. Uh, but then I just I just wound up selling them all uh, except for one <clears throat> And then uh, when they started doing these legacy figures kind of like uh, Making them less stylized a little bit closer to G1 um, that got my attention uh, You know, it's like what if the animated universe uh, Crossed over into the G1 universe Yeah uh, so that's kind of how I see these and I like it uh, some nitpicky things in the alt mode first the weapon storage is stupid uh, this I mean I don't know they could have I don't know what they could have done with this looks nice but I don't know the storage is stupid uh, the other thing I don't like is this right here I mean, that just looks bad, but who knows how else they could have done that. Everything else about the figure looks cool though. Very clean. I don't like seeing the swivel joints though. They could have covered that up, but other than that, I think it does look pretty cool. Here he is next to the Earthrise. Optimus, we have G1 Optimus with animated Optimus. <clears throat> and the Classics Optimus. So it's almost like the Classics Optimus is kind of an in between. You got a flat nose, then you start getting this slope, and then you have it here too. Then you have this wind vane at the top, and you have this this light bar. You have this blue going a little bit further in, not quite as far, but yeah. Oh, yeah. Transform him. It's actually very simple. Unpeg these, get them out of the way, and now he's a jet truck. Unpeg here and here. And separate there too. This Pegs right there. This folds together and pegs 
right there. Fold in the feet, and it kind of the friction holds in place. So peg, fold. And peg again, and fold again. And this, unpeg and fold backwards. This can unpeg and fold forward, revealing the head. So go ahead and rotate this too while you're at it. Oh, unpeg the arms. <coughs> rotate. These fold inward, folds downward. And these can peg onto the side like that, creating like a rib cage. This can fold inward. There's some nice detail inside. You can see a steering wheel molded into the plastic. Fold in, fold behind, unfold the arms. Bend this and unfold the fist. It's a lot of unfolding. And there he is in his robot mode. And I think it looks very nice. Again, I don't like animated. It's too stylized, but this one kind of reins it in a little bit. care for the face. I wish he had his face mask. Um, but it does look like a very sleek figure. Hey. Someone's here. Lilith. So Lilith and Boudicca are now three years old. Lilith. Excuse me, girl. You want to cuddles? We'll go cuddles after I'm done. <laughs> Come on. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> so yeah, I wish they would cover up the swivel. Um, style choices. I never cared for the blue forms. The black's okay. Uh, and then I wish he had a face mask. His axe can be stored in the back here. Or he can hold it right there. It's a cool looking axe, but I just don't care for him having axes. I want to give him a gun. So. He has guns. Now I'm trying to figure out which which guns he can use. The peg hole is very big, so everything kind of fits kind of loose. I like these blue ones. <coughs> I like energy weapons.
and we'll show them off with these guys. And I guess for now, you can stand in. And every time they reboot a series, it's always weird to see the choices for the lineup. You got Optimus, new version of Prowl, Bumblebee, Bulkhead, Ratchet. It's a kind of odd combination, but oh well. And that's for bad guys. I think he might be a good stand in for now. Also, have him. Here's the only animated figure that I still have. Shockwave. Here he is with the G1 Optimus. And the classics Optimus. cool together. Let's see what animated prime looks like next to Transformers Prime Prime. Prime. I think this figure could use a do over. And Game Reverse Prime. Movie Prime. Movie Prime and the Movie Prime and the Movie Prime and the Movie Prime. Prior. Huge. And yeah, I just saw the announcement for the upgrade for this guy. Yeah, it looks cool. I think I'll get it. So yeah, here's the animated universe Optimus Prime. I like it. Not my favorite Optimus. Definitely not my favorite series. But this toy is very nice, very cool, fun to play with. Hey, maybe I'll pose next to 
the three zero rotor on. And I think it's time to go. Lilith is waiting for me. There he is. Animated Universe Optimus Prime. Thanks for watching.